let's check out this shoreline in the last segment of my video. in front of you you are seeing is Lake Ontario on the US side of it from New York about to come across a congregation of Canadian geese just ahead a few hundred feet and under these uneven rocks willow tree See what happens if I throw out a little goose call to him. find anything in these little pools, these shallow pools. Wildlife. This looks like we have a snake skin here in the water. A type of snake has shed its skin.
has shed its skin. The molting season for the snakes. much for litter on the beach so we'll toss that up to the higher bank of the beach and uh, continue on. Earlier I moved a whole bunch of trash that was a few feet from the water so we can get in the lake about three to four hundred feet up on shore. This is a nice little pool here to see some wildlife possibly. Well, today the pools are probably too warm and they have been probably picked over by the snakes that I've seen their skin in the water and by the shorebirds possibly other creatures such as raccoons and mink that run around the shore banks now what you see here all of this is actually not a white sand beach this is all made up and compromised of the zebra mussel. Seems the water has washed them up very far. Now you're back on the beach again. A lot less zebra mussels to be in the way. They will cut your feet wide open if you are not careful and have bare feet. Every step along the shore and beaches. Some 
volcanoes or some type of bugs, insects, some type of wildlife for everyone to see. Get my feet wet here. Walking up around the beach. Kind of pretty how that tree is sitting just out of the out of the water. With all the waves, beautiful day, surroundings. Some rubbish here that can be moved on shore so that it doesn't break down and end up all plastic into the water, which could hurt the ecosystem little by little. bait bucket. Pull it up farther on shore. Hopefully it'll stay farther away from the water. A few ducks here flying by. Try to get them in view for you. Just out of reach. Yeah. We've almost come to the end of the walk, folks. And I hope you enjoyed it. You can subscribe to my channel by going to Lifestyle Nature or this video or any of the previous ones, clicking my picture and then clicking where it says subscribe. Definitely like and share the video with everyone who loves the outdoors, loves taking walks, and wants to get away and doesn't have the chance right now. Last view of the picturesque, incredible Lake Ontario. I said in the first video I made, there's videos, shoreline flat rocks, where you can walk down in quite a ways and then be in little pools before you would get into the deeper part of the lake. So this is life test here on Lake Ontario. I am Lifestyle Nature. Follow me, subscribe to me and my channel. We will see you next time for another great experience together. It's time for me to hit the trail. <laughs>